Hello all, Shoestring here. We're having a very stormy afternoon today. Power going in and out. And I thought this was a good opportunity to show you how easy it is and demystify some of the confusion about how to get a battery and an inverter to work. Okay, so what I'll be using is a 35 amp hour AGM battery, Thunderbolt I got from Harbor Freight. It runs around $79, I think, but I know you can get them because I got one of these for around $55 with coupon. I'll also be using a Walmart Everstart 400 watt, and I got this with a coupon several years ago, but I just looked it up. These are around $29, so all this is really inexpensive. I'm using the AGM batteries because if you've seen some of my other videos, you know you can charge these up and then put them on a shelf. And the energy will still be stored in there when you're ready to use it. I recommend you char charge them up at least once a month. And I'm going to show you how that how this works. When Mrs. Shoestring said, oh, power's going off and I need lights in one of the rooms. Let's walk through that. We are having a storm come through. Lots of power go going in and out. We don't really have anything in this area. Mrs. Shoestring would like to have some power right around here. So what I decided I would do is take the small light here and hook it up to our Everstart 400 watt inverter and 35 amp hour battery I have from Harbor Freight. Okay, so we're going to connect the batteries together. Turn the inverter on. See it comes on. 13.0 volts. So we know it is fully charged. Okay. Now, very simple. Take the light. Unplug it from that extension cord. Plug it into here. Turn the light on. And now, when the power goes out, which it will here any moment, we know she will still have a light in this room around where the coffee is because we have set it up. Real quick, how you fix something really fast, even when the power is going off and on. So, that's how easy it was. I took the battery, couple of cables that, of course, came with the inverter, 400 watt inverter, battery which was sitting on the shelf is now hooked up to the inverter lights plugged in now i've done this type of light before and i can tell you this 35 amp hour battery and this inverter will run this light by itself for several days definitely in your situation depending on what kind of battery you're using it will run for the evening or until the next morning and your lovely wife girlfriend husband, whatever you have, can easily, with no problem, have light set up just like this. So, if you like this kind of video and you like learning how to do these type of things with me, please subscribe and share and I'm supposed to say ring some bell. I'll have to figure out what that means. Okay, shoestring out.